Okay, um, the, we've basically got a massive space here and three marks to get um, in it. Uh, there are points, those points are on the coordinate grid and so the line segments A, B and B, C are perpendicular. So that means that the gradient of each of these multiplies to make minus one. So we've got to find the gradient of A, B, right, which is the rise over the run. So we're going to do one and four fifths minus three and four fifths, right. So whilst the numbers look horrible, they're not actually too bad. Two minus one and a fifth. Okay, so here we go. So that's the first thing. So we got minus two there over four fifths, which equals uh, minus ten over four, which equals minus five over two. Oops, I forgot minus. There we go. So right. So that is the um, uh, the gradient of AB. Now BC or CB doesn't really matter. Okay. We're going to do 3 minus 1 and 4 fifths, the rise over the run, remember, 5 minus 2. So that's going to be 3 at the bottom, and that's going to be 6 fifths. Oh, well, it's positive, so that's a good start, isn't it? So we get 6 over 15, which simplifies to 2 fifths. Excellent, that's all you need to do. Um, you could add in that at the end that uh, minus 5 over 2 times 2 over 5 equals minus 1. Okay, but you don't really need to. It's the fact that you've discovered both of these or calculated both of those shows it very nicely.